there. Cooking up some chicken. Uh, there we go. Cooking up some chicken here. These have gone up a dollar in price. They were twelve dollars. Now they're thirteen dollars for four chicken breasts. But it's still relatively cheap meat compared to to most things. Um, a year or so ago, I could buy two packs with six chicken breasts each for twenty dollars. I could get two packs, six each, or one pack for eleven dollars with six in it. Now I'm paying $13 for a pack with four in it. So it goes to show how much prices have gone up. But still, relatively speaking, it's a good deal. In comparison to other things, it's a good deal. But uh, it's just that nowadays what, what's a good deal isn't really what used to be a good deal. My water's boiling. Here's my water for my bottles. That there. I'll move this down here to the hotter part of the stove. There we go. Yeah. Okay, now we'll just yeah. start filling these bottles up. We will. Okay. I don't want this to, to spill over. Yeah, there we go. And then these will go into my drawstring bags, which are lined with white plastic um, kitchen catcher type garbage bags. In case these bottles leak, it'll all go into the bag and not into my bed, is the idea. And uh, they hold their heat pretty well. These will still be these will still be putting out some heat tomorrow morning. They will be. That's how good they are. So we'll put that one on there. Yep, you come up with innovative things when you're when you have to survive. You find ways to do it, and uh, there's no better way than to keep your mind working than to be in a situation like this where you're just you know you're doing whatever you need to do to to live another day, and you you you, you figure things out pretty quick. You have lots of incentive to figure things out under those circumstances. But anyway. This is just one of the tricks that I use. There we go. We'll put it in there. There we go. Of course, you always lose a certain amount of steam. So tomorrow, when I boil my water, I'm going to have to um, add. Going to have to add water to the mix. That's all. Okay. Now we bring this back over here. <laughs> I'll move my chicken back again. Send me back here. Okay, now grab up these bottles here. <laughs> these ones have to be boiled now. There's always stuff to do. Uh, these caps don't always want to come off. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did have one of these leak not long ago overnight. And I didn't even realize that it leaked until I went to take it out of the bag. And the plastic bag was full of was full of water. So that's how I realized that's how I found out. And that's a pretty good way to find out as opposed to having scalding hot water in your bed. Sometimes the plastic bag will actually melt even. I've had that 